We are going back to the island today. This is our second trip over, and this time we're going to do some things we couldn't do the first day. Well, we're there half a day because um, we can't leave Tucker all day. It's just too much. The first day we did the carriage ride. Today we're doing bike riding, right? Yeah, and I'd like to go to the Grand Hotel, check that out. So we'll head on over and um, make a day of it. Let's do that. Or half a day. Half a day. Half a day, okay. <laughs> Ten minutes into our uh, our bike ride, and Katrina broke it. She broke I did the bike. Not. <laughs> now the chain came off and it's jammed in the frame there. So we made a call to the office, and they're on the way over. I'm and uh, Christine, she broke the bike. Thank you. Okay, that wasn't so bad. After about 10 minutes, we're back on the road. up after that good i was calling for you back there i wanted oh. you to stop because oh, i saw an area that i recognized i thought it was nice and it's pretty much flat there's not many hills at all if they are they're just minor grades so all right let's go take these back in just, and yeah. let's go over to the uh grand hotel let's do it bye
second day on the island. Granted, mm -hmm. both days were half days. And what did you think? We did the bikes today. We went and rented bikes and we did the whole outer perimeter of the island, which took just over an hour. And that was pretty nice, except for when Chris broke my bike and then I had to get a new one brought out to me. Yeah, I broke your bike. <laughs> I would recommend if you're coming to the island to definitely tour the island on a bike, whether you want to bring your own bike or you want to rent a bike. I think it's well worth it. That's one of the better ways to tour the island. It is. And then what did we do after that? Oh, then we never checked. We went to the Grand Hotel. Yeah. It's worth checking out. You got to pay 10 bucks to get inside. Once you get inside, you can visit a few areas, two different levels, and then you can hang out out front on the porch. Sit down, rocking chair. Have a have cocktail a, too. It's very eclectic inside. I found it really charming. We had a great time. We'd highly recommend it. I think it would be awesome to come here and spend a couple days, don't you? Absolutely, I do. You know, stay at a hotel, spend a night or two so you can get up early in the morning and enjoy the morning air and the evening activities. Just the, just the ride around, getting up every morning, taking a ride, or even walking it would take a couple hours, but it would be fun. Trina will bring me another time. <laughs> She'll bring me another time. She'll hook me up and I will. <laughs> get me to stay somewhere real nice. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking the Grand. Nice. <laughs> yes. Hey. Somebody loves this area. Come on, he just Tucky. loves it. Come on, Tucky. Oh, he wants to uh, eat some grass. Come on. He says, I would like a lakefront view or oceanfront's okay, but I'll take lakefront. Either way. He's not asking for much, is he? No. You see how they're in pairs? Look, now he's not happy. <laughs> what can you I can do? tell when he gets frustrated, he look, eats look. his leash. Like he's gonna gnaw his way off. Look. Now, I know it's early in the season here in Mackinac City. Um, there are more people here today <laughs> <laughs> than when uh, we checked in. But you gotta admit, this is a beautiful campground. Well, it kind of feels like a brisk, you know, a fall day or yeah, it definitely cooled down a and, bit. Yeah, and the Polar can, Express is definitely back. It is. Are you going to explain the Polar Express reference? Yeah, we were, uh, the rig was given a nickname, the Polar Express, because so far everywhere we've been on our journey, for the most part, it's been colder, colder than expected. And then so, when we leave, it gets but warm. But that, that name's not sticking. Yeah, then when we leave, of course, it warms up. <laughs> that was a chance you take coming to Michigan this time of year. All right, Katrina and I have never had a pasty before. So we had quite a few people tell us when we're in Mackinac to try a, a pasty. We're at the, uh, where are we? Hunt's. Hunt's Mackinac Pasty and Cookie Company. So we're going to check these out. We're going to let Let's you know. We're going to let you guys know what we think. It smells good. Oh, that does smell good. Don't you? So how do you pronounce that? Pasties, not pasties. Pasties. Oh, well, apparently. Leave, leave it up to the Bella Fathers to mess that up. Apparently, that's it's not uncommon to, to call it that. That's true. She said they so. used to have a postcard so. in here that explained the difference between yeah. pasties and right. pasties. So what do we have here? These are the this is a chicken um, paste, um, pasty. Pasty. And yours is a stroganoff. Pasty. Stroganoff. We got it to go, but now that we found a spot, we're gonna eat it right here. Yeah. These are amazing. Simply amazing. Very good. Clarence, we're batting a thousand today. That's we're batting a thousand two. today. Two for two. Yeah. Yeah. Once again. And we didn't even leave the city. No. Uh, yeah. Once again, where are we? I forgot where we were. Hunts. Mackinac. Mackinac. Pasty. The woman inside said they're pasties. They're not pasties. Sorry, babe. The woman inside said they're... They're what? They're pasties. Pasties. First time we've ever had a pasty, uh, and it was fantastic. I so. think we might have to look into how we can make pasties, because they might be something easy that you can make oh, on the road. Oh, 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 hold on right there. Um, you said we. I did. I said we, which means Chris and I. <laughs> I'm not cooking. Yeah. Yes. It almost reminds you of a pot pie back home, um, but much very better. Good. Much very better. good. Very oh, good. Sorry. So, um, you know, 
We highly recommend the, once again, where are we? Hunts. <laughs> Hunts, Hunts Mackinac Hunts. pasties and cookie company. Go, check this place out if you're in Mackinac City. It's worth it. And uh, I think Katrina forgot to get cookies, so she's gonna run back inside. Let and me get, get some back cookies. in. No. Okay. We are leaving the Mackinac Mill Creek Campground after a week, and uh, we really like this campground. It's very nice. We're here early in the season, so there weren't a lot of people here. We would definitely come back, and I would like to come back in like June or July. I'd like to come back in the fall. Yeah, I, I would like to be around. I know this may, you know, some of you may disagree with this, but I'd like to be at the campground when it's entirely full because I enjoy that atmosphere, so. Yeah, I have no problem with yeah. that, but I'm thinking it would be nice to come in the fall too. All right, we got about a four hour drive. We're headed south, back down towards White, White. Whitehall, Michigan, I think it's called. Yeah, we're gonna stay on a friend's property and um, we'll be there for about a week. That's right. All right, let's go. Let's go. Been feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas throw me in open water. Let me have my peace and leave me till tomorrow. Wind into my sail. Away from things I let go, floating on the way. We go bottoms up, we go all the way. When you feel.